The amount of wastewater generated by around 10,000 people in the Dubai Investment Park or DIP community due to water consumption adds to around 2 million litres a day. Since water is a scarce commodity in this part of the world, water management firm Metito implemented a technology to recycle raw wastewater to a level where it can be used both for irrigation purposes and make up water for cooling towers. The amount of water which is purified by the firm from only one day of consumption in DIP would be sufficient to irrigate around 150,000 square meters of dry land. In an MEP Middle East exclusive site visit, Fadi Joes, Managing Director at Metito, walked us through its waste water treatment plant at DIP. Dubai Investment Park is very dear to Metito's heart and to my heart personally. Uh, it's a story that started in the late 90s when Dubai was coming up and developing its, uh, its resources and obviously they've done an amazing job through the years, we've lived through them all, but at that time this was a desert and this was just an idea, I thought, to develop a mixed-use industrial area where they will have industries and they will have residential area and they will have labor camps and they wanted to have a green community, so the idea of Building that obviously was directly linked with available fresh water and uh, the pressure this would put on the, on the main supplier of water, which is Diwa, but also the costs and the pressure it would put on the users here. So we worked very closely with the IP at that time. We being knowledgeable of what's happening and being the first, as I said, and foremost company, this area was always coming up with new ideas, but also that the IP management at that time that was really uh, progressive and understood what we were talking about and invested a lot of time with us to come up with this model. Uh, Public-private partnership, private-private partnership at that time, a BOT concept was not comprehended in this part of the world. This is the first of its kind in the whole of the GCC. And we had to work very closely with them to come up with a model where we believe everybody won, DIP won, because they got their water from recycling the sewage and hence reduce their bill by more than half. D1 because they reduce the pressure on water requirement that they had while they were loving to look at the tremendous growth in Dubai. We won because we had business, sustainable growing business of future to come. And most importantly, the people won. If you drive around here, it is a green community. You have like jungles of greenery. This is all from recycled wastewater, all of it. Not a drop of fresh water was invested in this part of the world. The other beauty of this project, apart from being the first of its kind in a public-private private partnership, the other beauty is that we made it a point to introduce new technologies every time we make a new development. But you have like five or six super advanced technologies when you walk around being applied in this part of, of the IP. Yes, From the traditional uh, extended aeration, surface aerators, it's te technical words, but this is the first type, to the uh, root enhanced uh, bioreactor that is just coming up in this part of the world. Included in the middle, MBR, MBBR, every technology can be. Biopipe, bio pipe, it's, a, it's a revolutionary concept of treating sewage in a pipe. All of them are here. Thank you for watching MEP Engineering on Construction Week. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel, like the video, leave a comment, and share it with all your colleagues. See you next time. Goodbye.